The Forest Management Bureau, or FMB, as a staff bureau of the DENR, provides technical guidance to the central and field offices for the effective protection, development, and conservation of forest lands and watersheds. Pursuant to Executive Order No. 192, Series of 1987, FMB shall undertake studies on the economics of forestry and forest-based industries, which include the demand, supply, and price trend situation of the country's various forest products. Over the years, the price survey has gone through many revisions to accommodate the needs of national policies such as the Forest Charges Law, the Price Act, and the system of designated statistics. In 2000, the DENR issued the Administrative Order No. 55, implementing the Revised Price Monitoring System for Forest Products, or the RPMS, wherein the FMB shall act as the central repository of the price data. Under the RPMS, there are two major price surveys being conducted by the DENR field offices. The survey on FOB or free on board market price of logs and selected non-timber forest products covered by the forest charges law. And the survey on domestic retail price of lumber, wood panel products, and other non-timber forest products. The two price surveys are being conducted on a monthly basis by the CENRO or implementing PENRO through personal interviews with the identified respondents using the prescribed survey forms. Based on the existing guidelines, the duration of report submission from the CENRO to the Bureau takes at least a month from the day of the survey. As the central repository of the price data of forest products, the Forest Management Bureau processes and publishes such data through various knowledge products. However, over the years of conducting the survey, the FMB encountered the following issues and challenges. Data generated is not on a real-time basis. Data analysis is limited. Budget and manpower constraints in the field. Implementation inconsistencies. And with the new normal, face-to-face -face interview is discouraged. And shifting to digital transactions is now preferred over physical transactions. To address the challenges encountered in the conduct of the price survey, the Forest Management Bureau is pleased to introduce the Mobile Price Monitoring System on Forest Products, or MPMS, to improve the data collection, consolidation, and analysis of price data. How will the MPMS improve the conduct of the current price survey? It will provide real-time submission, it will allow more in-depth analysis, it will require less budget and manpower, it will ensure proper implementation, it will comply with current health and safety protocols in the context of COVID-19 wherein face-to-face -face interview is being discouraged by shifting to digital transaction. With the MPMS, the respondent submits the prices of selected forest products through the mobile application. The submitted price data will be uploaded to the MPMS server, and through the MPMS web application all DENR offices can access the price data within their respective areas of jurisdiction. How will the respondent submit a report using the MPMS mobile application? Log in using the credentials which will be provided by the CENRO. Then, the list of surveys under RPMS will be displayed. When submitting a survey, select a type of survey. Click the Add button. Fill out the data needed. Click the Save button. Then click the Upload button. That's it. The report will be uploaded to the MPMS server. All DENR offices shall be provided with accounts to access all the reports submitted by the respondents through fpprices.denr.gov.ph. Using their user credentials, they can log into the MPMS web application wherein they can review and analyze the reports using the following features. The dashboard includes summary statistics of the respondents, status of report submissions and data visualization. 
The data visualization provides a glimpse of the price trend of selected forest products over time. The next feature shows the list of all respondents and their profiles within a specific area of jurisdiction. In the review surveys, the user will be able to access and review each survey submission. The last feature allows the user to generate and print summary reports for further analysis. With the development and implementation of MPMS, the DENR will be able to deliver a more effective and efficient public service through timely submission of reports and more in-depth analysis of price data. Moreover, MPMS will ensure the safety of our field personnel and respondents especially during this time of pandemic.